There it is, Jay's Sporting Goods. Place is massive. This is one of the most amazing hunting stores, hunting and fishing stores, outdoor stores in the state of Michigan. Absolutely incredible. There is my absolutely beautiful wife walking in the door right now. And we're gonna check some stuff out, see what we got inside of here. So let's take a look. When you come in, look at here, even right in the lobby. Nice, nice. Do they got any uh, old town? Oh, sorry, old towns right here. Gun safes, they got it all. Like I said, the store is incredible. We're gonna do some browsing. I'm not gonna film everything, but I'm gonna show you a lot of great things in here. But if you're ever in Northern Michigan, Claire or Gaylord in Michigan, best store. Great quality products, absolutely amazing everything in here. Uh, look at all the, I mean, again, I'll show you around, but this place is just awesome. Um, we'll see a ton of great things in here. Good on, we're on the back side of them, but look at all these safes. So like I said, we're not, we're actually not even in a store yet. We're just in the lobby part of the store. We've got gun safes, both sides, everywhere, Rambo bikes. These things are becoming more and more popular like crazy. A lot of people loving them. Very cool, look at the racks on this thing. Sweet setup. What's the price on these, do they tell you? It's rack. Got right there, whoo. That's pretty hardcore right there. All right, we just walked in right here. Look at Sitka stuff right off the bat. Boots. Tina shopping already. All kinds of options. Hey, how are you? Good. And we got over here the good stuff. Now, one downside is not finding many snake boots. But look at the options here. All quality, all high-grade stuff. Like I said, they don't, they don't play around here. I mean, this is uh, this store is amazing. They don't have to deal with a lot of the things that you get with like a Bass Pro and a Cabela's where the people buying all the stuff don't know what they're getting at or what they're doing. Um, I mean, you're talking here... These guys are all outdoorsmen, everything they do. And they do a really good job of it and they get the right products. They do fantastic. This is not just your run of the mill, you know, junk stuff. So as you can see, more stuff of everything here. Carhartt, we're gonna cover a lot of Sitka stuff. Like I said, it's nice to see the quality stuff. Rivers West always been very well. I've been very happy with Rivers West, except for the fact that I sent them a jacket that broke one time with a zipper and I never got the jacket back. I wasn't real worried about it, so I never followed through, but uh, so it may have just got lost in the mail, but that was definitely a bummer. But they look at, I mean, you know, the stuff you're looking for is here. You know, they have the, the, the quality stuff we're after as, you know, hardcore outdoor people. So you got all the options, even starting to carry in the solids. You know, how nice is that? When's the last time you've seen solids somewhere? You don't see, oh, those are really nice. Those might be going home with me right there. How much are those? What are those? 100 bucks. Those are awesome. What model are these? Let me see what these are. These are the territory pant. I like those. Those are pretty sweet. And now with me being down in Georgia and, uh, you know, doing most of the pig hunting stuff, see like that. That's so nice and light. $129. Now I probably wouldn't buy that. That's expensive. But, um, you know, look at the vests. I mean, this is right up my alley. This stuff is just awesome. I've never seen that vest from them before, ever. That is almost exactly the same as my Kuyu guide vest. $199. Um, but their prices here are good, too. Here's another pair of those pants. Right here, same thing. Are these territories? Yeah, territory pant and brown. Man, like I said, very, very nice stuff, as always. Like I said, they do such a great job here at Jay's. Here's real sickos. Um, they're, uh, what do they call it, game point? What is this rain gear called? I can't remember what they call it. Uh, dew point, not game point, dew point. Uh, but this is, you know, I don't like Gore-Tex and boots too much, but I love it. I don't mind it in the rain gear. And this, like I said, this stuff is, this is quality rain gear. I'd have this in a heartbeat. Um, simple, I love it. The full length zippers like I have on my first lights all the way up. Easy access into your pockets underneath. Easy on for boot access. Like I said, just awesome. These are also dew point. Yeah, dew point pants, 309. And a jacket's 3 309 I think I saw on here 329 so yeah I mean 600 bucks 650 bucks but again that's what I pay for my first light stuff so I pay for the Kuyu stuff you're talking high quality here I, I, I love this stuff
Stuff everywhere. We got the cross guns. Bunches and bunches of uh, cross guns all over the place. Anything you want to. And if uh, you look, they even got traditional ones. See, because it's a recurve, so that makes it traditional crossbow. Range right here where you can shoot. And you can test fire pretty much any crossbow, any bow. Tons of arrows set up here for you, so testing out things. You can see they do have a traditional section here too, which we'll show you, but you do see gloves hanging here. But we got ranges set up where you can shoot any bow before you buy it. They'll help you tune them, help you set them up, whatever you need done here. Measure your draw length. Um, you name it, they got the whole set up here for you to be able to uh, come into the range here and uh, use it. Good, how are you doing? Good, how can we help you? Uh, you name it, they pretty much got it. Everything is here. All kinds of memorabilia, things everywhere. As a matter of fact, if we look right here and what they call kind of the Fred Bear wall here, if you look closely at this picture right here, that is not Fred Bear. That is our good friend, Ryan, or Brian Burkhart. And uh, from Compton, you guys know him if you follow social media stuff. And uh, that is him right there. And his picture set up in here, just awesome stuff. Look at the bows. Like I said, they do have a good traditional section things on here. You know, you're finding the wikis, woodsmen's, you know, a lot of this stuff in an actual, you know, in a, in a big store like this. Great Northern Quivers, all your string making materials, silencer stuff. You know, they carry pretty much most of the stuff that you're looking for, and it's here in stock. Even got spine testers and, and string jigs and you name it, flint napping kits. It's all right here. You don't see that very often today in any of these you know in any big type stores this store is huge it's bigger than most cabela's or bass pro shops or things like that it is just loaded with high quality gear look at three river stuff look at your bow cases all your selway quivers great northern quivers all your stuff here all your arrow making supplies You know, they got pretty much everything we're looking for here. We'll show you their traditional section here in a minute as well, too. Bow fishing. You name it, they have it. If you're a target archer, all that kind of stuff here. I wonder, they probably sell like those weird nose guards that some of these guys wear now, too. Those are probably here somewhere. But they got it all. Look it up here. on. Look at this displays up here. Look at this. That's awesome. Great setup on here. Just a fantastic uh, compounds right here. Rows of them. And you know what I find is very unique here, what I like a lot, interestingly enough, you notice they have more compound bows than they do crossbows. When's the last time you were in a sporting goods store that had more compounds than crossbows? And, and we're talking Prime, Matthews, we're talking quality, quality um, compounds here too as well. You know, so you got stuff for everybody. And for those of you guys that are like me in the traditional world that we don't know a lot about all this kind of stuff, I, I mean, look at some of the prices on some of these things here. Um, right there, look at a price on that. $1,800 bow. So like I said, these compound stuff get pretty expensive compared to our world. But look at here. Look at how nice this is. You know, we got a whole section here of traditional stuff, and it's, you know, they used to have a bunch more. Used to have a much bigger selection. It's dwindling like it is everywhere, but it's still here. You got the Hoyt bows, Flu Flu arrows, woods, aluminums. You got long bows, recurves, you know, classic Bear Montana. One amazing bow. And, uh, you know, they got a lot of, uh, this, is this the Osabo, I think that's called? I can't remember what, no, that's just actually, oh, that's pretty sweet. That's a static. Or a, uh, yeah, look at that thing. Not sure, bear, but uh, they got it all right here for you. Everything you're looking for, all your rests. What arrows again? Another Hoyt Satori. DVDs. So their their archery department is very good, considering you know what the world has become today. Look at all your targets, all your options. It's a pretty sweet blind right here. Check this thing out. Quick, easy setup, just a little half, uh, what do I call it, it's the Alps Outdoors. But take a look at that, dude. 
that's a pretty quick little setup and ready to roll. That's actually pretty brilliant. Where is that and how much is that? That's made by Double Bowl. Double Bowl right here. Double Bowl surround view stakeout blind. 119 bucks. That is pretty cool. Not gonna lie. That is pretty sweet little setup. That's the Double Bowl one. Now that is not a Double Bowl though. That's an Alps Outdoors. And this is uh is this, is this, yeah, this is double bowl. I don't see this one set up because you can look. That one's got see-through mesh on the top. This one's solid. So I don't see that one to see the prices on it. I don't know. But that is pretty sweet. But just aisles of aisles. And rows of rows. Turkey stuff. You name it. It's all here. Look at all the shafts on that back wall. How you doing? Right back here. Look at all this. You name it, it's here. The chairs, the, you know, everything. This stuff makes me laugh because it's a legal debate in Michigan. And look at all that stuff we got. But it's like that everywhere. But you name it, it is here. Dog stuff. Saws. We'll check out some other cool stuff. Trapping. You don't see trapping in stores very often anymore. Look at a selection here. Very nice to see. And good quality stuff. Look at these drags. I mean, these are, you know, I mean, they're, you know... I mean, quality, quality stuff. Look at a sifter. I mean, we're talking good stuff in here. Not just your run-of-the-mill, make it happen. This is all very nice predator, all your calls. There's fox calls, your lights. Everything you're looking for right here for you. Now, normally your tree stand section is a lot bigger than this. Um... But I don't, you know, like I said, it might just be the off season. But you got your uh, XOPs, you got some hawks, millenniums, got all your extra seats if you want to. Harnesses, usually got a ton more harnesses. Like I said, I think that's just off season right now or something here. But usually, I mean, there's a lot more harnesses. Uh, but they got your, you can carry Kongs. Look at that. You know, I mean, that's pretty incredible. All this stuff right here. More con right there. You know, you name it, they have it. It is here. All your accessories, everything you're looking for. Everything that you're after is here. Saws. Some of these were these wicked ones. Look at the wicked saws. Yep, all kinds of options all over here. We'll keep working our way through because we got a lot of store to cover. Bike covers, Chris, line nine. more Chris. calls. Here's your stunt in your gun department. One of the best ever anywhere. Hands down, look at these here. I mean, they're just, you know, you can spend hours and hours in here. There's, if he, if it's made, it's probably here. In their gun department, look at this gun department here. Oops, sorry. You're right. Look at this. And keep in mind, you know how guns are right now, how how you none know, are available and how short supply. I mean, we are talking just rows and rows and rows. Oh, sorry. Rows and rows of guns. And then the back wall, as you can see there. also have a used selection of guns they buy and sell and trade your guns as well too here these are all used uh that they have here where they're new these are all used and then they got new but like i said they do give you that option uh if you want to sell or trade um you can do it right here as well too ammo department it's almost stocked when do you see that that doesn't happen very often but they actually got quite a bit here considering the time and circumstances thermals night vision scopes you name it it's basically all here for you and uh i don't know where their binos are usually they're in here too might have passed those or they might be further down each of your rows like i said more gun accessories than you could ever imagine if you look at here kind of just quickly we'll shoot through these but you got everything that you're looking for is here cleaning stuff choke to i mean like i said look at this this is this is the go-to store for many people 
and uh, two of them, like I said, there's a Claire location and there is a uh, Gaylord location, both very similar. The Claire one is the bigger one, um, but they both are fully stocked and carry most of the stuff. Look at this, this is my this was my son's favorite aisle. All the BB guns, all the stuff in here. You know, I mean, look at the size of this store when we just stop here in the middle and look. I mean, look at the size of this store. It's got everything you're looking for. Holsters, holsters everywhere. Grips, more gun accessories, bags, belts. It's all right here. And again, it's all quality stuff. 5'11", you know, reloading supplies. Everything that you're after is here. 5'11 pants. These are pretty sweet pants. I had a pair of these. I like these because they got the built-in knee in them. Those are really nice. And they flex. Gun purses for, for the women. You name it, it's here. Got all kinds of stuff. Fishing department. I don't know a whole lot about fishing, so we're not going to get too carried away in here. But you can see that they have everything you could think of is here. And again, we're talking quality stuff. You know, it's, it's look, I mean... You find me another store that's going to get the best hip boots ever made in history are right here. These are the trap, or trap line models. 165 bucks. Best hip boot ever, but you usually don't find these in stores. Usually this model, you have to go to a trap supply store to even find that. They got them right here, 169 bucks. Best, best ever. Now with me being down in Georgia, I would probably go down to the Marsh one because I don't need to insulate it. Um, but, uh, but absolutely just incredible you know quality hip boots you know great waders you got sims look at all the sims set up in here you know you got everything you got sick of waders you know like i said it doesn't get better than that costa costa however you say it it amounts up here zoom me in a little bit Such a great place. So many accessories, fly fishing stuff. They got the reels. They got the whole, like I said, if you're looking for it, it is probably here for you somewhere. I mean, just huge department. Again, we're not going to spend much time in fishing because I don't know what this stuff is, but they got a lot of this and they got a lot of that and they got a lot of those. Stuff here everywhere. Camping department in here is fantastic as well too. Look at here, all your uh, lodge stuff, some of the best stuff ever out there. My wife's got basically her whole kitchen is all of the lodge. But they got all the little stuff you're looking for in here too, things that you don't normally see. But I mean, this is a full setup of all that kind of things. If you're looking for it, it is probably here. Excellent kayak department, excellent for kayak and canoeing and all your water sports stuff. Love these coolers. My favorite cooler right here. I love this cooler. It's one I take on all my hunting trips. Mine's the old one, has a door in it, but just fantastic. But you name it, it's here. They got options for it. They got spices, seasonings, you know, all kinds of, all the, all the stuff you're looking for. Is here. Is that another one of those next right there? Discovery Solo. Here they screwed up really bad. This was a mistake, and I think it had to do with the loss of Rolex um, and not being able to use it in kayaks anymore. But this is eleven hundred dollars. It's a Discovery Solo one nineteen. Only holds two hundred ninety eight pounds and fifty six pounds eleven nine. Okay. So just kind of note those specs on there. My Old Town Guide. That I have my guide 119 old town guide 119 holds 450 pounds weighs 48 pounds and it was made out of Roylex and it only cost $5.99 when I bought it and it blows this thing out of the water this was the biggest mistake they did was get rid of the discovery or the uh the guide 119 and go to this solo one a uh, huge mistake on her part as far as for us for hunting and things 
you lose the capacity, you caught, it weighs more, and uh, there's just no advantage to it. I was really bummed when that happened. That really, really bummed me out. And uh, pretty sad. That's why I treat my baby, my Guide 119 canoe, because I it's does it's not made no more. Can't replace it. And that's a that's a shame that it's went that way. All your cutting board stuff, cooking stuff. Like I said, this place has just got it all. Lem, you know they carry lem, which is really nice. Number eight, big bite, and uh, number thirty-two, number twenty-two. I don't see. There it is, right there, number twelve. That is my grinder, right there. That is my. I love that grinder. Best grinder I've ever used in my life. Um, my wife has that dehydrator. Works fantastic. Uh, I need to get a mixer actually for all my sausage stuff i want a sausage stuffer and i want a mixer i'm just going to go with a manual one like this uh or no for the mixer i'm going electric for that and i want to uh i do not see here right now a mixer but i want oh right here right tiller mixer right here how much is that 500 600 bucks um but i want to get a mixer meat mixer like oh here we go 25 pound 459 179 that's probably where i'm going but i want a uh mixer for all my uh my sausages and so put everything in there that's on my to-do list this year all your seasonings and spices all that kind of stuff is right here for you got traggers pellet stoves you name it i mean like i said the place has just got it all everything you're looking for one stop shopping and their prices are very good. They're very reasonable. And like I said, it's quality stuff that you're looking for. You know, it's not, it's not, you know, the junk you see at a lot of the big box outdoor stores. They carry the quality stuff you're after here. Again, they're not restricted by corporate buyers to pick and choose based on how much they can get something for and what the bottom line can be. Here, they're carrying the quality stuff that they know that we want. And uh, they always have. It's the reason Jay's has been so good and been around for so long. You know, they got, you know, just amazing quality of stuff in here. What we got over here, so kind of go through. Yep, fantastic store. Good tents. Tent accessories. Oh, those kayak paddles. Packs. This is that Alps frame. I love this little frame they got. This is made by Alps Outdoors. No, nope, that's Terrain. Allen, or not Alps, Allen. That's what I meant. The Allen one. 139 bucks. But, and it's, uh, you know, it's your regular frame pack. It's got a load meat shelf load on there, but it's not real high off your back. You can take this top bar out so that it's not real high. And it's a pretty narrow for a frame pack. So if you're looking for a meat loading frame pack, uh, just to haul meat out on, this is a very good one at a very good price. Like I said, you pop this button and you can take them that right out. Me personally, I would probably cut these off. See how it's cut right here? I would cut that off right there and right there and completely leave them out. And then I would have this set up as a uh, meat carrying pack. But for 139 bucks, this is a quality, um, you know, good, comfortable pack on there. It's a pretty good setup right there. Be real happy with that. Uh, here's that uh, um, meat packer from Alps Outdoors. I think this is Alps. Pretty sure. Let me see here. Uh, extreme, but I thought that was Alps. Yeah, Alps Outdoors. See, two sixty nine for this, for this frame pack, and it has a. And it's not. I'm not knocking it. Alps does good stuff. Got a little thing on here, and you got a little meat shelf down here too, which is held up so I can't fold it. But two hundred sixty nine bucks, and it's probably twice the weight of this. And like I said, you lop that off right there so that it's not sticking up high and snagging on anything. Um, that one right there by Allen, who makes great stuff. Uh, like I said, 139 bucks. That's a frame pack to pack meat out that would last you the rest of your life and do just fine on your, you know, for deer hunting and pulling, pulling meat out of the woods. If you're, if you're quartering and boning them out there on the spot. Great, just great, fantastic options in here. You know, for one store to carry all of this and have all of these options, Osprey packs, you know, like I said, just a beautiful setup here. Gregory, Gregory's always been one of my favorite backpacks there has ever been. I love Gregory. They, they, I, I've got three of their packs. They do a fantastic job. They're lightweight, tough as nails. Um, you just can't go wrong with any of the stuff you're seeing in here. Top notch all the way around on every level. Camping and RV stuff in here for you. 
small packs for hiking and uh, backpack or uh, mountain biking, things that you're looking for. Great sleeping bag options, hammocks, you name it, it's here for you. Chair setups, lots of options. Look, they even got mountain ops. Yeti stuff, my wife's favorite tumblers. Clearance sections, so you got all kinds of clearance stuff in here. There's a super hot Miss Tina shopping. Browsing through, picking stuff. Oh, and she's got things in her hands. That means we're spending money today, apparently. Making it happen. More Rivers West, I love this stuff. This is what I'm going to go with for my pressure washing jacket right here when my Helly Hansen one dies. And uh, 75 bucks, but that is... You know, perfect for me, super tough, quality, durable, uh, stain resistant. That's exactly the setup I'm going to go with. As soon as my Heli Hansen one craps out, that's my next pressure washing jacket. Because I wear them all the time. I don't wear a pressure washing coat when I'm pressure washing unless it's raining. But sometimes I'm out there pouring rain. That's a nice setup. I like the Rivers West stuff. Browning. Got some quality things in here for sure. That's that Rivers West one right there too. 56 bucks but yeah that's the route i'm thinking about going to but you can see there are just endless possibilities in here as far as clothing regular clothes all over everywhere um even waxed canvas no that one is not i thought it was when i saw it back there where's but they do here sell somewhere in here they have though you know like this where it's waxed canvas this stormy but that is a waxed canvas material and it's they're just tough as nails and uh, they sell jackets and stuff like that in here somewhere too so options galore even sell steel targets right here a bunch of options for that canonite you know you got a little bit of everything clay throwers portable rigs for clay throwers automatic clay thrower setups with battery packs there's where all the knives are it's probably where all the binoculars are as well too so you get counters here everywhere. More safes, more safes. All of your knives, yep, binoculars are on the other sides. Bench made socks. They carry a lot of local knives here too that are made here in Michigan. You got Essies. Never go wrong with Essie. Love all that kind of stuff. Um, you even got tops in here, which is fantastic. But they do also carry White River and uh, some other Michigan brands. And uh, they got it like right in here, Knives Alaska. But they do have uh, all the ones bench made. See, like right in here, um, Hidden Canyon Hunters, uh, it's bench made. But they got options here for you everything you can think of binoculars. Like I said, great stuff. They got the piers right there. I've not yet seen, but those 8x42 piers, those are uh, those are pretty sweet. Those are very nice. That's that new line from Swarovski that just came out a few years ago. They have a huge clothing and gift department over here as well, too. Just regular everyday stuff. So if your wife doesn't hunt or while you're looking at all the hunting stuff, she's got plenty of cool stuff by great manufacturers to come and check out over here you name it they got it gift area over here i'll bet we'll find tina in here somewhere because we're getting ready to head out here in a second but i'll bet she is somewhere probably in here but as you can see everywhere you turn very cool knickknacks and stuff that they're into All kinds of options here Okay, apparently she's not over here, so we gotta find her. Alright, there you have it. Tina's just waiting to get somebody to pick that bike up for me. <laughs> <laughs> but it is, uh, there you go. You see it? Jay's Sporting Goods in the flesh. There it is. And uh, if you haven't been here yet, like I said, I'll peek right over here one more time for you. But um, as you can see, everything you're looking for, highly, highly recommend it. Store is amazing. Two locations, Claire, which is the one we're at, and then Gaylord, Michigan. Uh, there's a sign right there. We'll zoom right in for you. And uh, there you go. Make sure to definitely come by. Check it out. 
well worth it if you're in Michigan, Northern Michigan, and uh, they carry great stuff. Huge supply, huge stock. They also do seminars. Sorry, it's raining here right in the eyes, but uh, they also do seminars and workshops and all kinds of stuff for like predator hunting and turkey hunting and uh, all kinds of stuff there. They got like a whole classroom set up. So anything you're looking for, Jay Sporting Goods has it. Thanks for watching.